Hi everybody, how's it going? Today I'm going to show you my 2021 lawn care setup. And here we go. Over here we got my 2021 Advantage uh, dump trailer. Uh, I use this, I'm, I, well, I, I used it quite a bit already this year. Uh, I just wanted something small with that little dump all my grass and stuff. I have uh, a site in town, but it's Monday to Friday from 7 till 3.30. So after 3.30, I want to keep working. I missed the dump, my little dump thing. I can dump it in here. And Saturday and Sunday, I can't work unless I have somewhere to dump. Look at that rusty crap already. Oh, it wipes off, whatever. And it's got a little thing there. You reach in and up and down, whatever. It's a dump trailer. But anyways, I bought that new this year. It came in oh, about a month and a half or so ago. And I still got the, 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 the Dodge. Actually, the 96 is in pretty good shape. And I got my 6x10 PJ trailer. I've been using it a little bit. I'm starting to go back to the big one now. I, uh, I did sell my... Uh, old snow trailer it was getting tired I sold it so maybe I'll replace it with something else another trailer <laughs> anyway there's my 2021 dog hey Maisie my trailer equipment pretender blower racks my uh, mic uh, gas can holder it's an MZ uh, uh, 21,050. <laughs> That's a good job. And, uh, I got this, uh, uh, oh, dog's got me caught. There we are. This Catch Pro. It works pretty good. It fits on my 48 grandstand. 36 grandstand. Yes, I have a 36 inch grandstand now. And it'll fit on my little 32 Pro line. So that'll fit on all three. If need to catch grass if I don't have my other machine and I still have the old beater dodge it's on its last legs it will be gone in another couple months and I got the Chevy almost ready to go a few more things look at that isn't he pretty I bought the black rubber paint shit to go on the rims but it looks good I gotta do a few I went I bought this back rack thing uh, it's supposed to be a whatever, but anyways, I'm going to cut it off right here. And then it'll be a back rack, not a rip, rip whatever. But i got to finish doing that yet. And uh, yeah, looks pretty nice, eh? My 2005 Chevy shit. <laughs> That'll get somebody fired up. Yeah. And uh, we'll go around here. And, uh, yeah, best part about that Dodge is my decal. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to scrap it. Buddy wants the deck on it. Not. And uh, I got my little tool kit here with wrenches. I got a, a kit for fixing flat tires and stuff, plugs and that. I got a do flingy there, speed feed head, oil, chain oil for the aerators tools yada yada loppers stuff and in here I got my uh, my pull saw and then I got a, a hedge trimmer that goes on a combi engine and back in there I got a bed ray definer and also I got an extension there to put on the pull saw or whatever and these are plugs for that push mower I got and uh, ooh, let's get to the good stuff now yeah, we got, uh, I use these a lot religiously at this time of year. Power brooms for getting the rocks off of the grass. And I got the one for the uh, bristle brush for driveways and stuff. That's on a 94R. Those 56s, they say they're under power. Not a chance, man. You can get them in Canada for around 300 bucks. And who cares after two or three years, you beat them to death anyways. They're not so expensive. 
but anyways I got my uh, 800 with the full cord thing it works awesome I love it and uh, my 525 BX for a handheld blower I love it it's the best in the world best in the planet a eh, exterminator <laughs> and uh, I got my 700 and spare tire for my Chevy shit <laughs> and let's go in the garage we got some trimmers I got this um do you uh, not do well it's uh Milwaukee you know it's not bad I can get about two and a half lawns on a nine amp or eight amp battery it's pretty good it's got almost like a speed feed head on it kind of and this is my other hedge trimmer I got here you just can see what it is you know I think it's got like a about 24 inch bar thingy on it and I got uh, three of these bad boys uh, 525 LSTs uh, I bought that new last whoops I bought this one new last year this one new last year and I had two other ones this is my original one it's about three seasons old now the other one buddy wanted it and I said make me an offer he said three hundred dollars I said no no we'll go uh, we'll go 250 buddy so he gave me 250 for it I only paid five something for it up in Canada here and uh, there's my little cheesy MS 170 I beat the tar of that in the winter you know I cut skids and all kinds of stuff and it's good to have I haven't got my truck all loaded up yet because it's still early I'm just doing cleanups and there's a trimmer head for my combi engine a tiller and a ninja gas can Ooh. <laughs> and what else do we got in here oh yeah this is pretty cool I use this to sharpen my blades they call this this ain't the yellow hornet this is some aftermarket one I got off of Amazon and uh, I cut this and took a chunk out of it and brought it back a bit it was putting way too much of an angle but it even got a new set of blades for the 36 I said that 36 yes I guess I should show you anyways let's go out here and look at the mowers I bought this new last fall this uh, super recycler I liked it because it had the Honda engine on it and uh, yeah we'll stand back up so you can see it better yeah so there's the little 21 inch 32 inch I made my own uh, mic shoot on the side it's a BM 6500-C78910 <laughs> whatever <laughs> my jungle Jim sulky on the back and check out this bad boy oh yeah I just picked this up a, about a week ago or a little better my 36 inch grandstand I love that little guy got my decal on it I uh, tomorrow morning I'm gonna call Dale from quick shoot I was talking to him earlier he gave me the numbers and all that so when I ordered I can just give him the numbers and I'll have my new quick shoot on that in about a week or so maybe I'll make a video installing it yeah and then we got uh, it's funny uh, everybody has names for their mowers I call this 32 Tory I call this one mini me and I don't call this the beast I call this old red or no I don't call that red I call the air raider over there red I call this the bull <laughs> this thing's pretty good the bull and uh, red over here my air raider that thing made me fistfuls of money last year my buddy's getting one down in Toronto I can't wait to see his I won't tell you who but he watches my video he'll be laughing and then we got the Titan it's got no name just Titan I bought that uh, last fall I had a friggin uh, time cutter HD in the park and break and that wobbly stupid my right I just hated it I just I liked it but I didn't and the warranty was pretty much done with it and they wanted to get rid of this because 2012 well last year was 2020 but uh, that was a 2019 they wanted to get rid of it so uh, they gave me a smoking deal so I said sure bring it up so they did and any hoot uh, this baby I put uh, 
Uh, just a minute here. 252 hours. I just did the uh, hydro change on it. I put the filters on it. Excuse me. New filters on it. New oil on them. And he's ready to go. Everything's ready to go other than, I, I like this This one here will cut. And, oh, I played with it actually. But uh, uh, another week or so. I would imagine it's going to take a couple of weeks to come from Florida, the quick shoot, but uh, I'll get that on. That's a must. Everything has to have a quick shoot. I uh, cost me a, one of those big sliding glass windows one time. And uh, yeah, so it was $650 for a sliding glass window. So uh, quick shoot, uh, it's worth it. I have, well, these, this one here is a mic shoot, but I want something. I like the quick shoots on the grandstand, they're really cool with the handle and everything, how they got them. But, uh, these guys wanted me to make a video. Exterminator's been busted my chops, so. Anyways, you got your video. I don't know what else I can tell you. Oh, the trailer's uh, 83 by 20 lock. <laughs> Excuse me. I hope I didn't shake your too much. But anyways, that's about it, folks. You take care, toodles. Grandstands. Oh.